Hey what's up you guys, I'm Envision and in this video I'm going to teach you how to add the favorites widget to your iPhone without installing any apps. The new iOS 14 update added a lot of cool new features but for some reason they took away the favorites widget. To fix this problem all we're going to need is the shortcuts app which should already be installed on your iPhone and 5 minutes of your time. Now let's get started. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to your phone app and make sure you have your favorites selected. So if you don't know how to do that all you have to do is go to the favorites icon over here and then click the plus button in the top left and now choose the contact you want to add to your favorites so i'm going to choose adp and finally choose the preferred contact method i'm going to choose phone call and just repeat that for as many contacts as you need now the second step is to use the shortcuts app so slide down from your home screen and search for shortcuts and it should pop up if it doesn't just go to the app store and install it but you should have it on your phone now just click on the app then click on the plus button in the top right to create a shortcut. Now click on the add action button and you should be able to see the call widget right over there and it's going to display your favorite contacts that you selected before. If you don't see that just type in call into the search bar and then click on the phone icon. Now you should see the contacts from your favorite list. Just select one. I'm going to select father for example and then once it's selected click on next in the top right corner. Now click on the square in the left to customize the shortcut icon. Yours is probably a different color, but you can change it to any color over here. I'm going to select yellow. You can also change the glyph, which is that white logo in the center. They have a lot of options, but I'm going to go with the running man. Then after you've picked, click done. And it's going to ask for the shortcut name. Just make that the contact name. Then click done again. Now, as you can see, your shortcut is made. When you click on it, you're going to be able to call that contact right away. Now just repeat this step for all of the contacts you want to be on your favorites widget. Now it's time for the third step. So once you've had all your contact shortcuts created, you're going to need to click on the select in the top right and select all of them like I'm doing over here and then click move and then click new folder. Now name the folder favorites so you know that all your contact shortcuts are in here. You can also select a symbol if you want. I'm going to choose a phone and then click add. Once the folder is added, you can scroll down and you'll be able to see it. As you can see, mine is over here and it has all the shortcuts I created. Now go to the home page and let's go to the widgets page. So keep swiping to the left, keep swiping, keep swiping until you reach the widgets page. Click the edit button and then click the plus button in the top left. Now click on the search bar and search for the shortcuts app. Then click on it. And now depending on how many contacts you have, I recommend the second or the third widget. Select one and then click add widget. Now click on that same widget and then click on the folder and now click on favorites and then just touch out of that. And as you can see, all your favorite contacts are there. Then just click done and you'll be able to call them just by tapping on their names. Here's a demonstration. I'm just going to tap on the pink one. As you can see, it called sibling number one. Now, if you have more contacts than the space allows, you can double up on the widgets as well. And you can do that by scrolling down to click edit and then click on the plus sign. Then do the same thing as before, search for shortcuts, click on it, and then just add the largest one again. Now just drag it right on top of the other widget. So you just made a widget stack, now click done. And as you can see, you can scroll through the different pages and reach those contacts. Now let me show you what it looks like on the lock screen. So once you lock it, you can swipe to the left to reach your widgets page. And as you can see, your favorite widget is right there ready to go. All you have to do is swipe through and select a contact, click on it, and you can call them. Now, if you want to change the order of the shortcut icons, you can do that. All you have to do is go to the shortcuts app again. There it is. And scroll down to the favorites folder. Now, just press and hold on the shortcut you want to move. You should feel a little vibration and then just place it over where you need to place it. Now, just do this until you're satisfied with the order of the shortcuts. And once you're done, just swipe up, go back to the widgets page, and you'll be able to see that the change has been made. As you can see, when I click over here, friend, sibling number one and sibling number two are in that order. And as you can see, friend, sibling number one, sibling number two are in the same order over here. And that's all for the video. If you guys found it helpful, please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below if you need any help or if you have any video ideas. See you in the next one.